All right, so the Kepri build with the spears and the autopilot, it's basically like Mike Tyson punching a baby in the face and killing the baby instantly. The baby didn't stand a chance. It was over before they even knew what happened. And that's kind of like where the game is at right now. People are quitting the game. People are leaving the game because these builds are taking all the fun out of it. And there's all these people out there choosing to run hangers of five of these. I mean, these are no skill obliteration builds. They're really ruining the game. They're causing people to quit. If enough people to leave the game, the game will die and we will lose it forever. So think about that before you're before you choose what to run in your next hangar. Now the angler, that thing's just crazy, but I don't really think Pixonic realized these spears were gonna be able to do what they do. I mean, killing everything in one or two or three shots is just ridiculous. I don't think they realized that was gonna happen. Now, if the matchmaking was better, and it was only putting up the big clans versus the big clans, that would be a little bit different, but these big clans running nothing about the craziest builds, they're ending the game in one to two to three minutes. The games are just, instantly over because your regular player stands no chance the regular player sees that and they're like these guys are bullies and players are quitting players are leaving the game or they're barely playing right now it's almost not even fun to play out there right now i mean i feel like the biggest jerk in the world when i run that build because what it does to people is not right it's not fair but you guys are choosing to put five of these things in your hangar and just go out there and seal club everybody and everything. It is making players leave, and that is not good for the game. You want this game to be around for a long time, right? Well, so do I. So think about that before you choose your next hanger. But between the bad matchmaking, the crazy overpower builds, I mean, we've never seen builds this powerful before. There's been a lot of crazy builds, and it's been a big old pain in the butt, but this is to the point where it's just, it's, off the charts off the charts insane off the charts stupid and your regular player stands absolutely no chance in the world it's not fair it's not right so yeah think about that so between the people who are hacking the people running the overpower builds and the bad matchmaking it's really ruining the game for a lot of people i know pixonic is planning on nerfing these weapons which is great but Next time something comes out that's just overly power, overly overpowered and unbelievably crazy, please think about it before you just go ahead and throw as many of those as you possibly can in your hangar. This is one of the best, most fun games I've ever played, but right now these things are definitely taking the fun out of the game, so please think about that, guys. Please think about diversifying your hangar a little bit more, putting some other stuff in there, and not just running you know, five of the most crazy things you can possibly find that's gonna destroy everybody in two minutes. I would like to see players return to the battlefield. I don't wanna see more people quit. I just wanna see the game live for a long time and have lots of players and be fun for everybody. But these things are definitely taking out the fun of the game for a lot of people. Anyways, that's all I gotta say. Just something to think about. Lightning out, have an awesome day. See ya.